An asteroid about 45 meters in diameter is going to pass very near our planet on Friday, the closest ever predicted approach for an object this size. But there is no need for concern, says Lindley Johnson of NASA's Near-Earth Object Observations Program in Washington. No threat to the planet. We know the orbit quite well now. Johnson says asteroid 2012 DA14 will come as close as 27,700 kilometers, about one-tenth the distance between the Earth and the Moon. Close flybys of asteroids happen quite frequently. In fact, uh, in the last year, there's been like 22 asteroids that have come between the Earth and the Moon, but they're usually very uh, small-sized objects, maybe only a few meters in size. The 45-meter asteroid will speed past us at about 8 kilometers per second. When it's closest to Earth, NASA says the asteroid will be visible in parts of Eastern Europe, North Africa, Asia, and Australia. Skywatchers will need binoculars or a telescope to glimpse the faint point of light. Astronomers in Spain first observed 2012 DA14 last February. The orbit last year brought it close enough so it would be uh, within the uh, detection limits of, of the observatories that we have doing this survey. In 1908, a slightly smaller asteroid exploded over Tunguska, Siberia, leveling trees over 2,000 square kilometers. NASA estimates 100,000 objects this size are in Earth's vicinity. On average, one gets close every 40 years and hits every 1,200 years. The flyby is a remarkable opportunity for science, says Johnson. It provides us the next best thing to do in a spacecraft uh, flyby of an asteroid. Uh, It's kind of nice that nature gives us uh, these natural opportunities to examine these objects and learn all we can about them. NASA has plans to launch a spacecraft in 2016 to study another asteroid and to retrieve a sample for study here on Earth. Suzanne Presto, VOA News, Washington.